Yo, what's up? You know, I let you get some of the Oh yeah! Who are you voting for? Well, I actually do not have no idea why I'm voting or for who I'm voting for. Who are you voting for? To be honest, I don't know. Well, we gotta start thinking about something. Yeah. Wait, yo, wait, what's the line? But yeah, I honestly do not know who I'm vote for. Me neither. It's so whatever. Oh hey, come on in. We have an important lesson for you today. What's up? Glad to have you here. Well, here we have a very informational board on how voting is so democratic. Extremely democratic. All this information here will give you the back and forth of voting. But it's empty though. <laughs> okay, Action. welcome class. And here we have Trump. Trump? Obama. Obama? And a female Bill Clinton. A female Bill Clinton? Wait, wait, wait. There's a black guy? A black guy? There's a female? A female? <laughs> oh yeah, we're in the 80s. And then there's can we, Trump! Can we get rid of this guy, please? Yeah. Now a word from our candidates. There's Trump. Excuse me, ma'am. No. You can't. I you am can't smoke pro that in here. Marijuana. I am for it. So? I am for marijuana. And I also want to raise middle class income. I'm so? for plan B, C, D, E, F. A female bell? Action! And now, we have marijuana. We're going to show you the life of the friendly neighborhood drug dealer, Monty Lewis and how he struggles to get through it. Yo, man, I heard you got that Mary Potton hiding in a cloud, looking out of space, Mars even. I'm trying to guess some of that, if you know what I'm saying, my man. 20 minutes later. Sir! Sir, hey, sir! Stop in the name of the law! I'm Officer Bruno! Hey, sir, stop resisting! Whoa! Whoa! Stay still, sir! I'ma look in your pocket, sir. I'm not gonna hurt you. No police brutality. Sir, what is this? Is this weave, sir? Is this weave, sir? Drugs are bad. You shouldn't do drugs. Uh, if you do them, you're bad. Because drugs are bad, okay? It's a bad thing to do drugs, so, so don't be bad. By doing drugs, okay, that'd be bad. Drugs are bad, okay? Sir, I'm the law, sir. Respect me, sir. I'm just gonna arrest you, sir. Sir! No resistance, sir, now. You don't want it to be bad for you. Sir! Sir! She's gonna take your hands. You're going to jail for a long time because weed is not legal. Oh, uh, my fellow man. You know who I am. Uh, I would like to talk about affordable health care and the like. Okay? Now, upon affordable health care, I believe in gay marriage. Uh, you can see here by my boyfriend. Um, let's see. Let's see. Uh, I would like to say uh, immigrants, they can come in. Doesn't matter. Premier residency. Uh, Mexicans, okay too.
But I do love me, me taxing the rich. And that's why I stand firm on. A black guy? A black guy? And here in this scene, we have healthcare, where we have Amadis, an 18 year old mother of 18 kids. Well, here's the situation. She is applied for health care. But what does she do? She takes advantage of it. Hola. Oh, hello, Miss Figueroa. How you doing? Yay. Yay. You like him? I just Okay, okay, well, we are here to talk about your EBT situation. Oh. Yeah, well, according to oh. our, okay, according to our files, you haven't been buying food for your but children. But I have. Well, according to our files, you have not but been. I have. Like I said, according to our. Files, you have not been buying food for your kids. Yes, I do. I buy tortas, tamales, tuna fish, chicken, carrots, oranges, cucumbers, all of that. Well, we spoke to the store owner, and he said that he, you've been buying Justin Bieber tickets. That's not true. We spoke to the store owner, and you've been buying Justin Bieber tickets. Really? <laughs> Love your children. See, I just love Justin Bieber a little bit more. Mommy, mommy, hey, mama, I'm hungry. Hey, yes, so See, me. I love her. Okay. She just said she's hungry. Do you still care more about Justin no, Bieber than her? No, you. I told you I have okay. to buy a Justin Bieber ticket today. Oh, Justin I told Bieber. you. Okay, okay, let that go, Miss. Miss. Okay. Oh my god. You like my ears? I already said no. Okay. Do you still want your EBT? See? Si, I do. Okay. I really like it. I like buying the Justin Bieber TV. So do you still want that yes. EBT? Pedro! My name is Donald Trump. And let me tell you right now, I hate Obamacare. That's bull. If you want care, I'll give you a million dollars and you can take care of your family. Two, I hate taxes. No one needs taxes. You can just do stuff yourself and then people will buy more things. Three, abortion. No abortion. You're gonna have your baby. I'll give you a million dollars. You could raise it however you want to. Four, immigration. I hate Chinese and I hate Mexicans. I don't trust Chinese people. And Mexicans, they need to get out of this country, okay? I could give them a million dollars and they could just leave. They need to start like I did, with a million dollars. My parents did not come from Germany in order to see it be run by immigrants. You buy ticket? No. Watch me. We're going to introduce Marceline, a young lady, Amani, a young man, who's also a young drug dealer. They're going to have a kid, but they can afford to have that kid. And in this state, abortion is not permitted. Well, they cannot afford to have this kid. So that's a big, big, big problem. 
Dr. Bruno. You're welcome. I got something to tell you. I'm pregnant. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> What you mean? You don't know I was pregnant. This is not your baby? Really? Then who could it be? Whose baby could this be? It ain't Dr. Bruno's. <laughs> Congratulations on your baby, bro. Three days later. The friendly neighborhood drug dealer just got arrested. And I don't have any money to pay for this. And here we have Foreign Affairs, where we'll show you how outside Americans are treated here in America. Like the Mexicans. Mexicans? Diablo, mami, ven acá. Wow, mami, si yo quisiera ser Excuse me, excuse me. Y'all need to relax? My name is Officer Bruno. How many do we have? You gonna respect Sir. me? It, whoa. American first, please. No Mexican. No speaker the and Mexican. Speak American. English? American. This is America. We speak American. Now what's your name? Orphan. And what's your name? Ariel. Juan and Carlos. Now I'm gonna need some identification, please. Um, yes, sir. Um Will you leave us alone if we give it? Slowly, just slowly. Sorry. Whoa, 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 whoa now. Don't touch me now, Mexicans. Sir. You need to slow your roll. Sir, what are you doing? Um, you need to put that down. Drop the weapon. I said drop the weapon. And you need to stop with, raise them hands, stop where you are. Are you guys Dominican? Yes. 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 All right, back to Mexico. Compliments of Donald Trump. Alright guys, in all seriousness, voting is a very serious matter. You serious should... matters! You should ask your teachers what they think about voting. That way you can make your decision. DECISION! Without the proper knowledge or rationality, we can all just go to shit. Sh Do you know who you're gonna vote for now? Well, yeah! Who I want to vote for. Alright, so let's go. Okay. I hope that the person that I vote for wins. You guys saw that, right? Mm -hmm. Alright. Well, now that you have seen what the president is talking about. Here's what can happen if you choose the wrong president. You're recording. Oh, uh, I heard you have the guy locked up here. What guy? Uh, the guy. Are you Obama? You're Obama? Oh my god, go, yo, go ahead. There's a lot of guys in there. You can talk to whoever you want. Um, give me a handshake, please. Do not touch him! So, uh, my fellow Americans, I heard you got that, uh, very powerful, hiding in the clouds, space even, uh, that Mars crush. Uh, I'm trying to get that, for the sake of America. I'll uh, thank you. Have a good day. Please? <laughs> Mom! I want you! Mom! Yeah! Mom, your mommy! Mama! 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 <laughs>
So, this is what our country has come to with bad voting decisions. No knowledge. Marijuana. Black guys. What are we going to do now? You're right. You're right. We should go vote. We should go vote. Now that we have a couple, you know, a little more knowledge. A couple more knowledge. Wait, what? We can... We can what? That's a place now? We, we can, can vote there now? We can register there now? But like right now? I'm 17 though, I can still... I can still go? I'm 16. I can still go? You believe this? Where are we going right now? Where are we going right now? Guess where we're going. Where are we going right now? To Popeye's. To Popeye's? Bye bye.